Hello everybody and welcome to Honey Bunny Games. My name is Twisted and today we are going to be checking another mobile game. This one is free as well. It is Leap Day and it is really really amazing. I've been playing this game for the past, I don't know, four or five months and I play it a lot. Basically it's a one touch platformer that gets a new level every single day. And that's why I love it. So every day I can open up the app open up the game and play a new level. As you can see, I play quite a lot. I beat all the levels in May, I beat all the levels in April, I beat all the levels in March. And by the way, when there's a crown with an apple, it means that level has been 100%ed. I am now... I'm missing a few days in February. I can go back to these whenever I want, because I have them unlocked. I'm missing a lot of days in January, because I didn't actually... wasn't actually... Uh, home for this period of time, so I'm just missing a few levels, but I can easily unlock them by clicking on them, and I can uh, watch an ad just to unlock the level, and then it says unlocked permanently. But let's go play today's level. I haven't actually played it yet, so hopefully it's not a really annoying one, because sometimes it can be really unknowing. So how does Leap Day work? Well, you start out at the bottom of a massive pit. If you click your guy jumps, you can double, double jump and you can bounce off of walls. It's simple as that. So there is... As I said, there's a new level every single day, and they're all procedurally generated, so there is a bunch of building blocks that cons uh, that make up a level. So, for example, every section, you can see this is our level 15 uh, checkpoint, uh, between the bottom and between this area, we played two uh, level sections that get procedurally generated. We can check, we can use this checkpoint by playing 20, 20 fruits we gather, but I like skipping a few of them, because if you just pay for the fruit every single time, we will run out very, very quickly. So I like to do the first three sections without a checkpoint, and then get the checkpoint there, and then go down to two, and then go down to one as time goes on. Because the first few are usually very easy. The further you get, the more difficult the levels become. Oh, okay, this one is a bit tricky. So yeah, every, every section between two checkpoints is composed of two custom-made levels, and they are chosen by team. For example, today's team seems to be uh, bouncing around and spike and industry and stuff, so that's just gonna pull from the pool of levels that have bouncing and spikes and then have industrial looking themes to them. It's level 13, we can actually take the checkpoint here. Levels usually take, uh, depends, it depends. Between 15 minutes to like 40 minutes, depending on how difficult the level is, because sometimes they can be really difficult. This is really easy for now, because we are just starting out. But it's gonna get more difficult as we go along. There are some sections that are crazy, crazy, crazy difficult. I've seen them all, because I do play the game every day, but there is a lot of them, and since they're differently spaced out every day, it never gets boring. As you can see, as you saw, I've been playing this game, I think I started playing it... like, back in November. I haven't been playing it every day, but I have been playing it every day for the past few months or so. It's like my daily routine. I wake up, I get on the bus, and then I play my new Leap Day level, or do it before bed sometimes. As the level, new levels unlock at midnight. Which is perfect timing for me, so there is not... Okay, these guys are annoying. If you jump on them, you get killed. By the way, there are enemies, we haven't actually counted that many of them so far. But you can actually kill the enemies. Also, you don't have to get all the fruit, but if you get all the fruit, you get the apple crown, which is what I like in life. Let's get this checkpoint, because why the hell not? By the way, you can just... If you don't have the fruit, you can watch an ad to get the checkpoint, or you can just pay... Uh, I think it's five bucks to unlock the app and get all the checkpoints, but I haven't actually... The only reason I haven't actually bought the app yet, because I like this minigame of managing my resources to get the checkpoints. I'm... because if that disappears, that removes a part of the game that I actually really, really enjoy. Which is kind of silly, because it to me it feels like... I know it's not like that, but buying the app would actually make it a little bit worse for me, because I have such specific taste, I don't know. It's kind of weird, but I would recommend buying this app if you want to support the devs. Oh, I missed one. Okay, it's easy, we can go back. As long as we don't take the checkpoint here, we can just go back, no problem. Let's we'll just do that. We haven't actually died yet, I think, which is good. I'm doing quite, quite well. We actually will have to die if we want to get back, because there is no way to get past these little blockades. I'm actually gonna kill myself on this man. I'm gonna jump on his face, let him run into me. There we go, rip us. That's okay. Sometimes when you die, there is an ad. Uh, you can turn it off if you want. You can turn it off while you are not on Wi-Fi. So I am on Wi-Fi right now, there might be an ad, so we'll probably have to cut it out because I don't want to get in trouble for that. So if there's like an abrupt cut, that's gonna be it. That's gonna be the answer to the question, what went wrong. Alright, let's actually get these. We'll start dying soon. Okay, that was actually way too risky for me. 
I don't want to mess with this guy. So once you get past level 10, I like taking every checkpoint, because usually you have enough of a fruit backlog to be able to get all the remaining checkpoints. This is a tough one. You gotta, like, aim properly. Nice. Pro strats, pro skills. To pay the bills. There we go. The big fruit is worth five. So we do want to get that. Again, I usually try... In the beginning, I was just trying to get to the end of... Oh, god damn it, that's bad. As I said, in the beginning, when I started playing the game, I usually try to get every... Just, just try to get to the end. I didn't actually bother about getting all the fruit. But... Because it was really difficult in the beginning. You have to get used to everything. You have to get to know the lay of the land. But once I became really good at the game, once beating a level was very, very easy, I started just... Uh, Trying to get all the apples every time. And if I, for example, miss an apple by accident, it does happen sometimes, sometimes. If I do that, I'll just replay the entire level to get the apple. That's why I have all the levels 100%. I hate these lasers so much. Oh my god, they're the worst thing about this game. They're so annoying. This, this is gonna take us like 50 years to pass. Because you have to wait every single time, then you have to aim at this properly and get here easily. Okay, there we go. This is an easy one. If you get the difficult one, it's gonna be really annoying. There we go. By the way, you always run opposite of the way you were sliding on the wall. So you can count on it. By the way, the music is also quite amazing. I love it. I don't actually listen to the music usually. Because I listen to some podcast probably. Or some, my, own, my own music. But the music in this game is actually really good. This is a tough one. We, have, we can bounce on this guy, but we have to be careful and get on the spikes. There we go. We just skipped him altogether. These guys will turn back when they hit the spikes. So this is actually a perfect time for us to actually go up here. Get the fruit quickly and just jump. Okay, there we go. Level six. Okay, we're actually doing quite quite well. This might this looks like an easy level. I usually die a lot more than this. Doing quite quite well. We'll actually beat the game no problem. Oh, okay. Hate the lasers though. They really don't have to wait for them. And there's some really devilish sections with these lasers that are a uh, massive pain in the butthole. And I don't really like pain in the butthole. Okay, this is a safe area. Oh, it's not actually. Oh, good thing I noticed. Oh, no, don't get hit. Okay. There we go. All right, this one doesn't seem that bad, although that seems a bit annoying. There is like one section that's just a labyrinth of lasers. I'm gonna just wait it out a bit. It's just a labyrinth of lasers, and if you like miss time it by half a second, you just die. And it can be really frustrating to beat that. There we go, just stay in the safe zone for the time being, and then we're gonna bounce back get the checkpoint level five we got the silver trophy which is very very gucci i like that we don't have many sections left we have four sex points left we are gonna be okay i just want to be careful about this one again as i said the further we get the more difficult the levels become okay all righty there we go that was a really easy one actually at the end, like, so the final section is different every single time. The final section never repeats, it's always a new part of the level. And sometimes they can, they can be really easy, sometimes, sometimes they can be really, really hard and take, like, 50 tries to, to accomplish. Alright, this actually seems perfect. Walk into this bad boy and then do... Okay, okay, that's bad. Don't get lost, thank you. Okay, that's gonna be easy. We just have to get these guys out of the way. Okay, there we go. Nice. Stupid soldiers. Right, we are almost there. We have enough, more than enough fruit to get all the checkpoints that are remaining. Oh, this is bad. Bad, bad, bad. My part. This is a kind of a tough one, because we have to do like a nice little spin around. God damn it. Okay, there we go. I think we made it. Alright, this is kind of a little labyrinth section, but once you figure out how to do it, it's actually really easy to figure out where is the right path, and it's actually this one. There we go. Okay, we are actually almost at the end. This is a lot faster than I expected. Yes, I am that good. Like, this is one of those labyrinth sections I was talking about. This is hell. So you have to, like, not mistime this one at all, otherwise you're boned. You can hide in here for the time being. Okay, that was... I would have made it, but I didn't want to risk it. Didn't have faith in myself. Oh, it's gonna be bad. No, 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 okay, no way, no way, no way, no way, all right. Try again. 
Try again. We might actually spend most of the video on this very section. Oh, get him! Oh, so close. All right. I hate I hate the lasers so much. I can't believe we got the la. I hate the only thing I hate more than lasers is snow, because you have to melt snow by touching it, and that can be really annoying. Because if you fail, you have to like reduce so much. It's kind of a shame we got this level today. It's okay though. Not a big deal. All right, just keep on bouncing. Alrighty. Ooh, oh no! Oh, I missed- oh, I messed up so bad. We had it there, guys, but I fail. I should not have done this. That was bad. That was just poor on my part. Come on. This is the one. I can feel it in my bones. In my trombones. Ah, uh, it was too late. That's bad. I'm gonna die here. It wasn't the one, apparently. I was lying to you guys. Alright. Again, you, you have to bounce... Oh, that was so bad. You have to bounce at exactly the right time to not hit the wall over there and allow it to just run and bounce up then as quickly as possible. Ah, it's too risky. I don't want to risk it. There we go. Jumperino. Ooh, oh, thank God. Oh God, this, this one is even worse. No. I hate my life. I've never seen this one. What? I've never seen this section, I think. I don't know what to do here. I've never seen this one, I think. Oh God, okay. Can we make that? Not sure. Maybe we have to go all the way up? Can't quite say. That was actually easy. Once you get it, it gets in your finger and you know how to beat it easily. I mean, maybe... No, I think it's better to let it just go to the side. Okay, let's... We need more time. We need to uh, time it perfectly. We have to be in the air while the laser is still glowing. Once it becomes uh, the little square things, no, that longer does damage. Okay, awesome. Ooh, okay, we got it. That was actually nice. Oh, we have to get this, though. Okay, stay safe. Okay, we got it. All right. Time for the final challenge. We have whales. I hate ghost whales. Oh, they're so annoying. Because they float everywhere. Do we actually have to jump between them? I don't know. It's kind of weird. We have to aim at this thing. Okay, this doesn't seem that difficult. Again. Okay, I... I uh, changed my mind. This does seem very difficult. Eh, it's just, just waiting, right? Yeah, it's more or less just waiting. Okay, we just have... We could go between these guys, but no need to. Okay, this seems to be like a really easy final section. Basically just requires patience. Again, not all of them are super difficult. Some of them are quite easy. Oh, uh, there we go. We did it! Did we get all the fruit? Please tell me that we did get all the fruit. Yes, we got everything! Because we are amazing gods. Nice. Gonna level up a bit more. We can unlock new characters and poses and stuff like that. So we can look over here. I'm playing as Root. I think I have everything unlocked. I think we have... This guy seems awesome. He has like little prongs out of his face. This is the basic character. You start out with this guy. Plays this guy a lot. Plays this guy a lot. They're all the same. They just uh, have a different sprite. That's basically the entire difference. I like this guy. Soldier 26. Get it? <laughs> Scalp. I like this man though. I've never seen this guy. I'll play as him. Yes. He's my new guy. He is my new champion of the light. But yeah, I am going to just end this one here. You can check out Leap Day. The link is going to be in the description as always. It's really fun, really free. I play it every day and I would recommend it completely. But yeah, I'm going to actually just end this one here. Thank you guys very much for watching. My name has been Twisted from Anybody Games. Now we'll see you next time.